is different than fiction, and it's they're, they're, the two are not the same. Um, now, f when you when you're writing um, when you're writing nonfiction, to me, this is something that is based on fact. Naturally, in the process of writing, there are going to be things that you remember differently than other people. I mean, if you've been in a room with if you've been anywhere, if you've been, if you're a human being who's had any kind of interaction with other human beings, you're going to know that we experience things differently. We remember the, them differently, and we quote them differently. We pick up different things from what we hear. So inevitably, when you write about things, this is going to be informed by personal experience, and it's going to be informed by what you remember by memory. Um, so I think there is room for that. What there is not room for is things that, that have never happened and that you claim you're to, have, to, 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 to have remembered. This is something that you see, right? We've seen that with a million little pieces. Another thing that I think is obviously completely unforgivable is when you, um, you have this great idea for a novel, but then somehow you think it's not going to sell and then you turn it into, oh, well, actually it was nonfiction. I mean, this is something that has happened. I mean, um, I forget her name, but there was a woman who wrote about how she was with these, you know, gangs in L.A. And, and so there's also a dimension there of who the storyteller is in, in these situations and who the people are who are written, being written about. And, and, and you start to see patterns. Um, when you see these fabrications. Uh, I mean, I remember there was a woman from Chicago who wrote about um, honor killings and she wrote it as if it was, you know, you know, nonfiction. And it was clearly a work of fiction. I mean, down to the mistakes about geography, she didn't even bother checking those and put them, <laughs> and put them in this supposed memoir. So there was a scandal around that. So, I mean, there are patterns. And the reason that people get so upset is because there is a particular contract that gets established between reader and writer. When it is fiction, the contract is, I made it all up. Come along for the ride. And when it is nonfiction, it's like, look, this happened. It may not be exactly what other people who experienced this event remember, but it is my experience of it. Okay?